Say, uh, say, could I pr program you to kill? Jesus Christ, that's that's fucking brilliant. Well, close neural pathway, blah blah blah, and rewrote remaining functions. Neural pathway zero x six three a eight two rerouted through neural pathway zero x three seven four e eight two. Stand by. Full motor functions restored. Diagnostic reveals no critical failures. Asshole. Well, Jesus Christ, man! Uh, initiate the protocol again. Medical procedures initiated. Administering treatment. Please stand still. Is he gonna hurt me again? Or did I actually f Oh, look, I think I fixed the robot. Look at that. I fixed their fucking robot. Medical procedure complete. Further instructions. Well, can I- Yes. Acknowledge. Well, can I still kill him? All right, I, I, I guess I cannot tell him to kill people. Let's see, I'm gonna see if my limbs are hurt or if he, yep, there they go, they're fixed. Um, okay then. Okay, you guys following me? I'm gonna leave the room to make sure dog meat is. Okay, yep, yep, they've lost their mind. They're fucking retarded, walking into walls. <sighs> dog meat, you had to do it. You had to stoop a level closer to Sharon, didn't you? Just one level closer. Mm -hmm. You were already a mile ahead of him on the goddamn ass kickery meter, and you just had to drop one. Ah, <sighs> oh, you're killing me, dog meat. You're fucking killing me. Um, now if dog meat were to be an enemy, oh my goodness, I would be kicking his ass. I think I think I could do it. I know he's a tough cookie. I I once tried to kill him. Um, actually, I did kill him before, but other times where it's like I shot him just to see how much he could take, it's ridiculous. Usually, it's like, he'll just regenerate health because you have to reload. I mean, you can do it. It's kind of difficult, though. But it can be done. Hey, Trooper 99th has, is now offline. That's a little buddy of mine from way back when. Um, and this, oh my god, look, oh my god, this causes a lot of fucking lag. That reminds me, you know, I want to save my fucking game because I got, like, this game, you know, it freezes up every now and then. Every now and then, it will, uh, you know, it will freeze. It will fucking freeze, and you have to shut the system off. You know, you can't go in the PlayStation menu, you can't just eject the disc, nothing. It just freezes the fuck up, and you can't do anything, so I was... You know, and, and this was the only time it happened on a different character though like I had everything in the game beaten except the broken steel missions and you know I my mind just went fucking blank oh right right okay I got it so I was walking around it was near rivet city I had to talk to someone and then I walked down the road and then it froze so I shut the game off and for an hour I kept retrying. I, I was ready to chuck something at my fucking TV, but I can't do that. It's a good TV, an expensive goddamn 32-inch uh, LCD TV. I actually had to turn around and look at my closet because my TV box was still in there for the size. Uh, Bigsley, yeah, I think. Yep, Bigsley. That's who I wanted to talk to. Um, oh, this thing is... Oh, cool. He resupplied shit in there. I want to be hidden. Turn around. Find that again. Yep, fuck you then. Oh, I was just hidden. Whatever, doesn't matter. Chump change in there. Hey, Bigsley. Hand it to you, kid. That was a brave thing you did, risking your life to start the purifier. But do you know, you've made my life a living hell. <laughs> like I give a shit, Bigsley. You look like shit already. The wasteland probably has more important things to worry about. Don't you? I don't think I like being called the hero of the wasteland. And a hearty hello to you too. Uh, what's uh, what's this about a purifier? I don't know what the fuck that is. If you want to play make believe, fine. Go right ahead. I got real problems in the real world to deal with. Well, you know what? Everybody's got something. Mm -hmm. got <laughs> hey guys, my name's Big Lou. <laughs> You're all my scapegoat. <laughs> Sounds like you have your hands full. Everyone was so excited about that purifier. Project Purity this, Project Purity that. Yeah, I fucking know. I was there, motherfucker. Hey, what are we gonna do with all that? What are we gonna do? Guess who gets to fill in that tiny deal? You? It'd be one thing to guess so. But that little war with the Enclave has depleted much of the Brotherhood's resources. What did it deplete? 
ammo, <laughs> nigga. Please, what? I took on. I've taken on armies of Enclave, and I still have plenty of ammo to shove up my fucking ass for later. Is there anything I can do to lend a hand, pal? Really? Well, yeah, well, if you need psychological uh, therapeutic means, then I can't help you there, friend. Uh, but if you need if you need me to be your errand boy, I guess I can help you out as I've helped every other person in this game. Put your experience and talents to far better use. Yeah, okay. That sounds good to me. Uh, how can I help? Well, I've got Rivet City water caravans needing help with some uh, unusually organized bandits. Need someone to go investigate what that's all about. Oh, yeah? And then there's Megaton. They want more Aqua Pura. I just sent a shipment to them. Need someone to go visit Megaton and see what their problem is. Hey, Cabron? Uh, let's see, so what is the deal with Rivet City's caravans? Don't get me started about Rivet City. They feel entitled to everything. Always whining about how they're our scientists and all that crap. Like they did us a favor. Thought the security deal we'd worked out with them would be you know, a win-win. My hope was they'd completely take over the water caravan escorts by now. But I got Officer Le Pelletier bitching about an organized bandit syndicate. Guess they don't have the chops after all. Nope, Cabron. They I don't. Need you to go visit Officer Le Pelletier and lend a hand. Okay, I will see what assistance I can offer Rivet City Security, sir. Great. Hopefully you can get them straightened out. We really can't do this without them. Alrighty, uh, you think maybe Megaton is trying to con you out of water? I don't know what to think. I got lions breathing down my neck about it, though. Apparently, Megaton's sending him nasty letters demanding a shipment. I just sent them a week's supply. A month's if they ration. Look, if you can straighten out Megaton so I get lions off my back, I'll make it worth your while. Oh, okay. I'll see what I can do about Megaton, sir. Really? Oh, that's great. Uh, I'm sorry I can't offer you any support in this. All our resources are uh, tied up at the moment. Good luck. Oh, and uh, of course I have a little something for your efforts, if you're successful. Stay safe out there. Hmm, I don't need to be safe. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Uh, seems like a lot of trouble giving it away. Why don't you just sell the water? Many of us keep asking that same question. The Brotherhood isn't a postal service. We have important things to do, and we need caps and technology to do it. Lyons is on some kind of mission. Has he forgotten about the Enclave? That's our priority. But yeah, things are being done to offset the cost of Lyons' little pet purity project. Oh, so you guys have something set up on the side? Okay, I know you got something set up. Don't worry. I won't tell your superiors. Yeah. You don't seem like the goody-goody type. <clears throat> but don't spread this around. So, this ghoul, Griffin, comes in wanting to purchase a bunch of water. <laughs> what the hell does that droopy, irradiated fool need with pure water? Thinks he can sell it in Underworld. <laughs> the moron. But, you know, he's the only one who's offered to pay for water, in caps and technology. And what Lyons doesn't know won't hurt him. There's plenty of water to go around. And I can use it to pay Rivet City to provide security for all the caravans we can't escort ourselves. I, I'm, I'm lucky he came along. Well, uh, okay, I think that's the only, I think those, that's, uh, slipping on my fucking words, um... I think those are the only three quests that this guy will give uh, for the Broken Steel stuff, but I'm just going to make sure. I have some questions about the Project Purity operation. By all means. I'd love to answer some questions. I've got nothing. Ah, oh, sweet then. All right. Good thing. Uh, let's see. Uh, okay. Well, that's nothing. Ever think about people bringing up... Eh, that's... Is it hard bottling that water? Is it done by machines? Uh, just, let's discuss other matters. Okay, let's see. Uh, mind if I ask questions about your role in all this? Sure. It's not like I'm going to be able to get much done today. Oh, you got tomorrow, buddy. Think of it that way. 
Uh, you look pretty tired. How you stuck with this job or disguise? Uh, what you take on? No, it's all I was curious about. Absolutely nothing. All right, all three quests got them started. Won't have to come back except for the reward. Uh, given that, you know, I think only one of them I actually have to come back, but I don't. I don't remember. Um, but I guess I will find out, won't I? Ooh, I got my metal blaster. I love this fucking gun. This thing's pretty sweet. Um, however, um. Like, I'm, I have kind of mixed feelings on the laser rifle, which technically is a laser rifle, if you want to think about it. There, I mean, there should be no reason why it's different than a regular laser rifle. I mean, it's only called a laser rifle because some kid with a stupid speech impediment is a fucking retard. But it does more damage and shit. It's a good fucking weapon. Yeah, it, it sure is. Uh, oh, I don't even have those discovered. Uh, okay, I guess I'll go from Girder Shade when I do that. But, oh, fuck, I just... Because I switched the subject, I fucking just lost track of what I was doing. Oh, laser white. Okay, the the metal blaster is good, but the laser rifle is a lot better at long range. Uh, 